What's going on guys, my name's Liam and we're back on the Aether 2 server, but we're by ourselves again, we need to get some people on. And last episode we did some cool stuff, we actually went into a dungeon with Win and Poet, and uh, off camera I found a tiny bit of Gravitite, I've already enchanted some of it just to check how it works. And so I quickly would like to make a Gravitite sword, um, if I can do that very quickly, I'll take these as well actually. Um, but yeah, last episode you can see I got a couple of cool stuff which I'll mention in a second, but we need some of this first and then I'll go on to towards what I want to do this episode and then as a result of that then next episode we'll be doing something cool as well um, but yeah this episode I would like to first of all make this gravitite sword which uh, we smelt the gravitite by doing this we place it in the enchanter which gives us enchanted gravitite and from this we can make our tools so that's very cool let's try and get some sticks here as well and here we go. The server's been very quiet all day, actually. Um, there's not been many people on it at all. Well, we've got our Gravitite Sword now. That's pretty awesome, if you ask me. And we'll put the rest of the Gravitite away. Um, but this episode, I want to go and find some Acre Plants. And the reason for finding the Acre Plants is because, as I mentioned previously, we found some cool mower eggs last episode. And you can only tame the mowers through using Acre Leaves, Acre, le acre Petals, excuse me. And, um, yeah, to find acre petals, you need to kill acre plants. So that's what we'll, do, we'll be doing this episode, but they're very rare from my understanding. And also we found some music discs, so if we've got time, probably not this episode, but next episode, we'll, uh, we'll go back to the overworld and find a jukebox. Because we can't make it with normal logs, so we're going to have to go and cut down a tree in the overworld. Um, but, yeah, this episode is hopefully going to uh, be kind of fast. Um, hopefully we're going to get our little uh, task done fairly quickly and find these acre plants without much trouble. I'm hoping anyway, that's never the way it usually turns out, but uh, if we can find some, that'd be great. I'm gonna probably head in Wind's uh, house direction because I've not explored this yet. And I think Poet's house is somewhere over there, so we're, I think we'll head over to uh, check out Poet's house, but this is Wind's house over here. We're pretty much neighbors, it's pretty cool, you know, just saying. Um, but yeah, so we got my house is over there, if you can just see it. Oh, I also changed the house a bit. You can see I replaced the uh, the skyroot logs, the skyroot planks with a holy stone. I changed the roof to make it like a smurf hat. And the fencing is now um, oak, not oak, um, skyroot walls. So that's pretty cool. I'm happy the way, with the way that turned out. I took a lot of inspiration from Wind's house with the roof. That looked really cool. And check out what she's got. She's got like a little runway thing. So you can just like run straight off it. That's really cool. Yeah, this is Wind's house. And Poet's house is just over here. So, well, I don't think it's a house yet, to be honest. I think it's just flattened land. But uh, soon enough, I'm sure Poet will have his house. And you guys really enjoyed the last episode, so uh, you, uh, you you guys always love it when Poet's in my videos, and you you uh, you met Wind for the first time. Um, so, yeah, it was a lot of fun recording those guys. Hopefully I'll be able to do that again pretty soon here. That's one of the great things about being on a multiplayer server is that you always have the chance to collab. But as I said recently, the server's been very quiet. Um, I've been on for maybe about two hours today, and I've always only been the only one on. The reason for that is probably because I'm a Brit, and I'm the only Brit on the server, unfortunately. I'm going to see if these drop anything. Um, did he just go... Is that what the Gravitite saw? Does it make you go flying? Oh, that's cool. I like that. I want to test it on the Sheep Puff. Sheep Puff. Here we go. Sheep Puff. Go flying, my pretty. Oh, I'm going to love this Gravitite sword. That's awesome. That is a really cool uh, thing. Let's get these oranges as well. Take the coins. We have 31 coins. Oh, that's what we're looking for over there. Those are acre plants, I believe. And they're very dangerous, but we need their loot. So we're going to have to... We've got no choice but to kill them. I think I got very lucky, actually, from uh, finding them that soon. I'm, uh, I'm quite surprised we got that lucky, actually. Let's see if I can make this jump. There we go. And then we'll uh, drop that here nice and simple. There we go. But yeah, this is what I made my uh, fence out of. You can't make it, you just have to gather it, and you get them from those trees. So it's, that's uh, how I made my fence. Let's tunnel our way up here as well. Hopefully we can reach these acre plants. I'm surprised they, um, there's some acre plants quite close to spawn, because usually they get first things to go. I'm not sure if they naturally spawn, actually, but I'm pretty sure they spawn with the world, and then once they're gone, they're gone. But uh, yeah, I might be wrong on that. I think they actually might naturally spawn. Just as you, as the game progresses, perhaps. Um, but yeah, I'm sure you guys know. So let me know: do those things naturally spawn, or do they um, just 
spawn with the generation and then once they're gone they're gone I'm quite interested to know actually but uh, yeah these are the first uh, acre plants I've seen I'm guessing these are acre plants anyway I think they are let's get a bunny on our head boop we got a bunny oh also um I recently donated so I get a cool little message now we cannot thank you enough for your contribution here have some fancy visuals so now when we get a mower I've, uh, I've given it a special skin um, I think I quite like the Phoenix mower. I think that's kind of cool. So at next episode when we get our mower, we're gonna have a Phoenix mower. I'm really excited for that. But right now we got ourselves a bunny and it's looking awesome. Okay, I don't want to take these. Um, let's put the bunny down. We don't want it. We want it to stay safe. There we go, bunny, stay down. Oh, I wish I had some sort of um, bow and arrow, but okay. Okay. Oh. Okay, we got some uh, strawberries there. We got no acre petals though. Oh, you're not you're not an acre flower. I'm loving these uh, rainbow strawberries though. Rainbow strawberries. I think I called it a rainberry strawberry. Okay, well they did no damage whatsoever. We got some rainbow strawberries. Sweet. But uh, no acre petals unfortunately. And maybe you don't get them just from killing them perhaps. Unless he's a special actual acre plant instead of the uh, I think they were called carry-on sprouts I'm not sure to be honest I should have paid attention um, but I, I thought that's how you got them let's have a quick look see if we can't find any more it's a bunny here let's put a bunny on our head just for safety because bunnies make you float so uh, pretty much resistance against fall damage which is really nice hmm looking for these um got the name there what was he called I j I've said it like a million times and I've completely the names just escaped me acre petals there we go acre acre flowers I just had a, a what is commonly referred to as a brain fart you'll have to excuse me <laughs> okay let's try and jump down here we we got a bunny on our head and it's looking awesome whoa 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 are we taking damage we have a bunny on our head I think I just found a glitch. We should not have taken damage, should we? Unless I've got the entire aspect of the bunnies wrong, but I thought that's what they did. I thought they um, protected you against fall damage. But apparently not. Just took quite a bit of fall damage as well. Okay, didn't die, to be honest. Okay, let's find these acre plants. They've got to be here somewhere, surely. Some orange trees around here. You can't ever get enough oranges, so... Gimme, gimme, gimme! I want me oranges! Looks like this is new terrain as well because we've got orange sprouts. Interesting. Very interesting. I was telling, um, speaking to Hope before, and I, I have to say, I love these white flowers. It's like, Poet, I love the white flowers. And he was like, Yeah, yeah, shut up. And I got sad. <laughs> Any, uh, it's a land green sheep down there. There's no flowers. I wonder if uh, there's different biomes in the Aether, I'm wondering. Nope, it just says we're in the bi Aether biome, so that's uh, fair enough. Can't really go wrong with that. I'm just getting no luck here today. We found the wrong type of plant, and then we can't find the right type of plant, and... Oh, it's just a disaster. Oh, um... So, a couple of episodes... Well, all the episodes before this, I was complaining about um, lag on the server. And it turns out all I had to do was uh, dedicate a tiny bit more memory towards the running of Minecraft. And it's still a problem on the server's end, but I can sort of make it a tiny bit better just by dedicating more memory towards Minecraft. So that's what I did, and it seems to be working so far, but I do get occasional lag like, spikes due to the uh, the alpha of the mod. Alpha of the mod? The, um, the fact that the mod is in alpha. So, uh, yeah, that's not too great. Um, I might just quickly hop off and do some... Oh, a blueberry bush. I'll be taking that. Oh, another one. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Oh, another one. <laughs> just in my way now. I'm not sure I approve of this. Oh, my. Another one. Oh, what's with all these blueberry bushes? I'll take them home. 
I wonder if you can plant these rainbow strawberries. That'd be kind of cool if you can. Hmm. Getting no luck at all with these plants, am I? It's weird. I, I, nothing seems to be spawning, really. Um. Not getting any um, zephyrs spawning. That's kind of weird. Getting sheep and everything, but no zephyrs. Which is very peculiar. Some bunnies over there. Let's go pay a visit to uh, the House of Poet. Kind of House of Poet. The, uh, the Land of Poet, we should say. Oh, something broke. Oh, wow, the rings take a lot of durability, don't they? That's not cool. Why you got to do that to me, durability? This is Poet's house, by the way. And I think it looks fabulous. The Xanite ring sucks. And that's all I'm going to say on that. It absolutely sucks. <laughs> it, I don't think it did anything, and it wore out insanely fast. Okay, we're at spawn now. There's the portal. Um... No acre petals, though. What? I didn't even do anything. I didn't take any damage, and the ring just broke. That's not cool. Hmm. Not getting any luck at all with these um, acre plants. Let's try and branch out this way. I don't think anyone's been this way before, so... Venturing into new land here. Try and just tunnel over here. Nice and easy does it. Every time. Oh, here we go. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Right, let's pull her up. And back down and jump. Oh my, I need to... Uh, <laughs> I almost died then. Whoa. It's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Oh, awesome. We've got some Xanite over here. Let's get that. That's uh, probably a good indicator that no one's been here before. So I'm guessing that some plants might be over here. Some acre plants. I really hope they are called acre plants and I'm not looking for the wrong thing. But I it might probably just end up you need to feed them ambrosium. <laughs> and I will rage very hard. But I was reading the wiki and apparently you do need to feed the mowers acre petals to, for them to grow up. Usually takes about four acre petals, so I don't know. Maybe they can take rainbow strawberries. Who knows? That would be like the best case scenario ever. Is that they turn out to eat rainbow strawberries? Can you plant these? Let me check. See if you can plant these. Doesn't seem like it. I'm guessing you can eat them. I mean, they are strawberries after all. Hmm. Can't see any acre plants. Yeah, the wiki did say they were really rare. I'm not sure that's actually out of a uh, out of the actual code, but they didn't don't always spawn in properly for some reason, so they don't spawn in at all. I mean, well, obviously some do spawn in, but like, think uh, the plants that were supposed to spawn in sometimes don't. Apparently, I've read that somewhere, so need to be careful about that. That's probably why they're so rare. Yeah, we're not having any luck finding them at all, which is a. Uh, I would have thought we'd found some by now. Especially because a lot of the Aether is. Well, all the Aether is just open land. There's no caves or anything for them to spawn in, so I'm not sure. It's very. Uh, very peculiar to say the least. Let me uh, come up here. I've got some more bunnies. We want bunnies, but no plants. More bunnies, more bunnies, more bunnies. Oh, what are you? Are you a plant? I thought I saw a plant. I am hallucinating. Is that where I came on? Yeah, this is where we found the plants the first time, isn't it? <sighs> oh, it's daytime. Okay. Having absolutely no luck at all. We are really close to spawn though, so maybe that's why. We've got our bunnies, but they don't do anything, so... Hooray for useless bunnies, I guess. 
Nothing. So you what, I'm going to take a little walk about until I find these acre plants, and I'll be right back with you guys when I find some. So, don't move the muscle, I'll be right back. Okay guys, I've not had much luck finding any acre plants, but I did find something very cool, and right there is some gravitite. So I'm going to try and work my way over. I had some problems with zephyrs before I start recording, so hopefully they're all gone now. We can just focus on getting this gravitite, because gravitite is like the equivalent of diamonds in the aether. So I really want to get this, if we can. As safely as possible, of course. But it seems like we made it without much problems. Okay, let me turn this music down a bit as well. I always try to get the Aether music to play while I record, because it sounds amazing. Like, you guys don't even know how cool it sounds. Well, maybe you do, maybe if you played the mod, then you know how cool it sounds, but, uh, it, it sounds very cool. Let me just leave it at that. Um, I'll actually quickly show you guys what's cool about this, uh, Gravitite Ore. Um, so you can see it's on the bottom there, nothing really special about it, and if we take the top block, as gravity suggests, we get, uh, it floats up. Let me just show you quickly again. And boom, they float up. So that's really cool, I think. I think that's a really cool addition to the mod. I think it's a bit special about that. I wouldn't even know where to start coding that. I wouldn't know where to start coding anything, to be honest. But uh, that in particular must have been very difficult to code. So well done, guys. And um, I think I'm going to head back to the base now because I think I've pretty much given up on the search for acre plants. Um, so let's head back up here. Pretty sad that we found some gravitite, though. It's always nice to find stuff like that, because it is, it's the equivalent of finding diamonds. So it's always nice. And you can see, like, the sword has special effects, like, everything in the Aether has special effects. So, uh, Xanite gets better as its durability wears out, um, normal Skyroot tools will have a chance of dropping more loot, or two logs if you're cutting down a tree, or extra mob drops, stuff like that. Um... Holy Stone has this chance of dropping Ambrosium when you use it, then I think that's it actually. So we've mentioned Gravitite, Xanai, um, Holy Stone and Ambrosium, not Ambrosium, um, Skyroot, so that's what all the all the ores in the, in the game do, I can hear a Zephyr. There we go, I think we've finally reached the top. If this drops some Ambrosium, I can quickly demonstrate to you guys um, what Holy Stone does. Let's try and get some ambrosium here. Nope, not doing. Oh, you're a cockatrice. Where'd you go? There you are, cockatrice. Ah, you're a zephyr as well. Oh my god, oh my god, I don't like this one bit. Okay, you're there. Oh god, this is painful. Oh, they're just everywhere. Just put like a little hidey hole, maybe? We can just jump into. Okay, there's a cockatrice there. There's a sheep off there. Um, more bad stuff over there. Oh, there's a tempest over. That's kind of cool. There's a cockatrice. Let's kill the cockatrice. Kill them. Oh god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, run away. Quickly, 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 quickly. Okay, here we go, nausea's run, uh, worn out. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna have to uh, tunnel in here till a uh, daytime poet. Give me sanctuary, please. And um, so yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. Sorry about the lack of acre petals. But, um,. I'll probably have some by next episode, or if not, then we'll go back out and have another look for them next episode. Um, but we got some rainbow strawberries, so I'm going to see what we can do with those, or you guys can let me know what we can do with those. We got some gravitite, which is awesome. We got a bit more xanite, which is always nice. And uh, apart from that, I think that's probably uh, going to call that a pretty successful episode. I'm going to eat myself a rainbow strawberry over here. And uh, yeah, we're going to call that an episode, guys. Thanks for watching. My name's Liam. This was the Aether 2, episode 5. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, leave a like rating, and I'll uh, I'll see you next time. Later, guys.